a year ago December, uh, the boat building program was didn't have a place to go, and Lorraine and I decided to donate the Seine Loft to become the Hamilton Marine Learning Center. And it was such a reward to see these kids down there building boats. Uh, kids that didn't have any interest in school, but yet they had a lot of interest in, in the boats. And then they learned that they really wanted to learn different things, math and geometry and all that stuff. So they, uh, they really took on to learning this whole thing. And then this year, there's been $20,000 worth of uh, money donated in little flowers in memory of the rain. And we've just found out that uh, uh, there's gonna be a $50,000 match grant that people can match up to $50,000 uh, from Friends of the Museum, Penobscot Marine Museum friends. So uh, that's pretty exciting. Well, my name's Greg Russell, and I'm the, the head instructor on the boat building program at Searsport High School and Penobscot Marine Museum. And the reason for the program, or I guess why it, it's there, is it's a way for students to use the skills that they've already learned in school. It's a practical application of math and science principles, is what, the, what they uh, actually call it, I guess, because nobody wants to have a shop program anymore. But they, it, it's, you know, when you think about it, boat building is all about math and science and physics and chemistry. It all goes into the blending of making the, the product. The, the program is run with um, myself and a lot of terrifically dedicated and talented volunteers, and that's how it all really works. That's what I'm trying to pass on to the kids, give them an experience of, of making something and having them enjoy its beauty and you know I hope that'll be motivating for them you know we don't expect these kids to go on or many of them to go on in a career of, uh, of boat building but maybe they'll go they'll appreciate their ability to make something with their own hands and, and uh, you know either do it professionally or um, in an amateur way. It was fun actually it's fun to get away from school for a little bit and enjoy the build something with your hands. That's how I learned the most, so it was fun to, to use all, all the tools that I found out now. I didn't know those, what those tools were, and now I know what they are now, so it's good. It's good using the stuff that you're allowed to use in the future, and just getting out of the classroom. It's, I find it a lot more fun to be outside the classroom instead of just sitting inside and just doing paperwork. It's a lot more hands-on stuff, and it's a lot more fun. Thank you.